Howdy folks, Hendrik here from the beautiful downtown Auckland at the Chocolate and Coffee Show. There's a few interesting things about these kind of shows you find in New Zealand. It's an opportunity for small artisan businesses to connect with their customers, but it's a lot more. You're going to find some cheese and chocolate combinations, some beer and candy combinations. That just makes this an all-round beautiful and fantastic little country to visit. We wish you were here with us. Why do chocolate and coffee show? Why not do chocolate and coffee? I mean, is it not the perfect thing? There's a lot of development happening in the world of these two. A lot of collaboration. They see the value in it. They get to talk to their customers face to face and find out what they want. My, my passion is, is helping people get on a journey to understand how to get better coffee. So what I try and do with Jack's Coffee, which is, which is all about bringing a, a, an experience to people, is show people the do's and the don'ts. Our cheeses, they complement nicely with the new Whittaker artisan range of chocolate. What we have done, we just put it together in a little cup, right? <laughs> it's all about smell, aroma and texture. Good work. Chocolate is good, cheese is good, put the good and good together, you got twice as good. We do, a, we do a range of really fun products. We're using about nine tons of macadamia nuts a year. Doing this for 12 years, this is the most fun I've ever had at work. We brew our core cool range of beers and ciders, so we've done a stout two ways, a white stout and a black stout. Yeah, full rocky road taste. Have you tried it? Did you want no, to try it? No, we haven't tried it yet. Yeah. We're going to try it. Cheers. Off we go. Cheers, fellas. Today we're just sort of serving some nice brewables rolls to give our students a really good experience on learning to do mass catering and working with our clientele and working with different people. If you're going to have it, yeah, you're going to have a pretty good experience. In New Zealand you have the best limoncello and not, and not in Italy. The lemons in New Zealand are very, very good, like incredibly good. Salute. 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 Thank you. Yeah. Mm. Uh, Brazilian cheese bread. We Brazil have and Brazilian chicken delight as well. But probably the secret is the uh, recipe that my mother has for 57 years. From Brazil with love. There you go. In New Zealand, who would have known? One day we put together some so bourbon good. with some local honey and you know, it would taste good. We sell online or uh, you can buy it all over Auckland, slowly working its way right throughout the country. We're making all natural nut and seed butters. Salted macadamia. Yeah, 3% Canadian maple, just under 3%. That's the only sweetness. You heard that, um, Canadians? <laughs> but I, I'm really interested in this because you check, right? That's right. So you know what this is for sure. So Pilsner is the actual city in Czech Republic. They engaged with me saying, you sort of the keeper of the craft, we would like to do something together. And one day I had an idea, how about I use your beer and the hops to make the caramels. It's a beer caramel truffle, dipped in dark chocolate and then rolled in white chocolate shavings. We do things like tarts, greens, gattos, gelato sticks. So everything we have is handmade, hand painted, made with the best chocolate bar runner chocolate. We make beautiful, amazing, yummy cupcakes. That's a chocolate salami, New Zealand style. Well, we just slice it and put it on your cheese board. This is the next best thing to having a can of beer. Mm. Beer jelly, yep. kiwi style. That's right. Food shows in particular have really done a hell of a lot to promote this sort of thing. It just really helps the process and opens up people to try a new thing. But I think if you add to that, that we Kiwis, we travel a lot. We, lo we like to go around the world. We like to see what, what people are experiencing with regards to, to food and to drink. We bring that back. You too can become part of this journey. Come help us. Let's celebrate these businesses together. Donate to our site www.forwardtofavor.com and we will bring you more of these exciting programs.